Hello, I'm the Zachary Dryer, and we've got some more Cataclysm. I uh, kind of went and built up a vehicle or two on the off-screen. Hmm. I guess it's time to go raid that library. Wait, in other news, I am annoyed. Oh, and I made a bow. And where was it? It was up here. It's not that far. Okay. Um, oh yeah, I'm annoyed because... I was supposed to be meeting with my uh, guidance counselor for college. Like, it's his office hours and everything. And he told me, like, I emailed him last, the beginning of this week, or whatever week it is. It's like, hey, I need to be doing summer classes because things happen. What do I need to do? And he's like, meet me in my office hours. I'm like, okay. And I check his office hours. It's like, oh, it has this day, this day, and this day. And all except the one day. Oh, hey, <laughs> I have a class exactly overlapping that time. That doesn't work. <sighs> but yeah. Wait, this is my vehicle. It's really heavy duty. Uh, I've got cargo spaces where the bike is. Uh, I've got a reclining seat instead of having a bed somewhere. Got five point harness because you need that. Two engines, the uh, 6.5 4 liter V8 and the 7.95 V8. Uh, double batteries. I've got, let's see, electronic controls in both the doors. And uh, here, this is a lighted aisle. Here we've got a kitchen unit, the a welding rig. This is empty at the moment because I couldn't make what I wanted for it. Chemistry set. And then this is a water purifier, also not quite what I want. I want to upgrade it all the way to the food co, which I do in fact have indoors now. Which is right here, food co. There's a bunch of really random stuff. But yeah, this is this. It's all heavy duty and everything. Really nice. And the speeds are pretty reasonable. <laughs> I do say so myself. This up here... Actually, I need to uh, remember vehicle position and get back down here. Oh, and I am sitting in the middle. Remember vehicle position. There we go. And this is basically just a giant cargo thing. I want another cargo space for there. Um, oh, right. I need welding goggles. That was one of the reasons why I came back without getting as much stuff as I planned on. Um, all to inventory. That would be armor? Or is it... Um, I don't know. No, it's probably just clothing. To clothing. Clothing goggles. Not seeing any. I thought I had a spare pair. I'm. Oh, wait, there they are. Guess I should just carry it with me. No damage. And with this, I can actually show you what the uh, light is like with it. Don't even have to go in the vehicle because I've got the control panel. So, uh, I've got headlights, which this time I've actually got done correctly. Let's see, how did I do it? Uh, this one's facing straight ahead, this one's facing over there, this one's facing here, and then the two on the far sides are facing forward as well. That seems to take care of the odd points. Uh, also, we have the aisle light right there. And that's basically just so I can have easy crafting. Then if we come up here, turn on headlights, we've got a similar design except because it's only three wide, I had to uh, put the forward ones on the this spot and this spot. And actually, there we go. Mobile gas rig. Uh, it's named that because originally it was only going to be like a 2x2 two two with a welding rig and a bunch of uh, gas tanks. 
ended up doing a bit more with it because it was it's really annoying to drag around anything that's not uh odd square i think or maybe it's even no 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 because this has the weird it's difficult to drag anything that's not a single tile like really really annoying difficult Oh yeah, I repaired everything. Yep, yeah, okay, good. There we go. Onto this road, because we'll want to use this to get where we're going. At least part of the way. Huh. Well, that's odd. The lights seem a little off-center since it's still going. Whatever. It doesn't particularly matter. It lights up enough. Of course, we get to see the area that's surrounding the immediate vicinity. And now that we're going into the, uh... Dang it. Okay, no damage. That's the one thing that I have to be careful about with this thing. It's weak. It is completely weak. It's not meant to be strong. If it gets in a fight or anything, I'm doing it wrong. Its purpose is very much just drive around, and if there's a car on the side, I'll uh, go up to it and be like, Hey, you got some gas in you? <laughs> and then siphon it. Though I think... The gas station here has working pumps. gas with that. Did that do it? Choose gas pump. Um, cancel. Which pump is it? No. I'm assuming pump three. Buy gas. Oh, oh no. Choose pump two. Interesting. Choose pump one. Maybe it doesn't have working ones. It's like, I guess that's a possibility. Uh, okay, up to 51%. That's really nice. There we go. And turn on headlights. Zoom. Oop, nope, I was already zoomed out. And it's snowing. Um, how is the temperature for me? Got a few. Let's put on the long underwear and the European arm sleeves. There we go. How are we doing now? Uh, a few things are a little cold. My hands are cold. Um, now, turn on dome light. Modify closing. Where's my hand stuff? Uh, let's just go with the. Do -do 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 -do. Love liner. Oh, I can't actually do that. Interesting. 
Then we'll go with the... Oh, yeah, what? The gloves, I guess. No, can't do it. Oh, I don't have... I'm a derp. I don't have clothes or stuff to do that with. That would cause a problem, wouldn't it? I should probably check if that uh, other pump is working. But I don't feel like it. Cut it all up. Okay, with that, I should be able to... Let's try to modify the glove liners again. Uh, no. I need fur or wool. Fair enough. None of that's fur, none of that's wool. Hmm. I have some at home. But that's not here. So that doesn't very well help, does it now? Twenty is about as fast as I want to go when going through a field with a vehicle like this, just because it seems that I can dodge most things at that speed. Yeah, this is getting a little too fast. I don't mind fast. It's just we're driving something quite delicate. Now, is there anything on here that I care about? Forgive me at the location. There's a few things, I guess. Um, first of all, reinforced windshields. Uh, and actually off headlights. Okay, now let's go back to this. Uh, the five-point harness I'll grab. The controls I'll gra grab. Do I want the gas tanks? Um, most of the stuff back here except for the actual frames themselves. want to get that cargo space. Do I want the gas tank? I'll go with it. Why not? Um, anything here? Not particularly. Do I care about the headlights? I'll grab it. There's no reason not to. If I remember correctly, I completely lost the, um, what's it called? The only other important bit here. Yeah, the, uh, battery. I lost the battery. Which is a shame. Under me to there. Nine. There we go. And actually, we have some cargo carriers, so I can very much go and, uh, or cargo space. Got a gas tank there. Uh, I want another battery here, so I won't put a gas tank there. That was the only uh, gas tank we had. Okay, cool. Uh, for 
first of all. Let's eat some jerky, drink some water, stop driving. Um, I'm going to go back down here. I feel nervous about leaving my vehicle. But I don't want to be sleeping in that kind of situation. So we'll come over here and sleep. There we go. I think I cleared out this town some, so it should be relatively safe here. Boop, doo, boop, doo, boo. Getting light out. Now we're not tired. Probably should have slept before I left the house. But, eh, you live and learn. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to take Sleepy for my next character. This would convenient for this particular playthrough to get me into the groove, but now that I've got a feel for the game again. I'll definitely want to uh, deal with it all myself. Tori. Um, we have some frying pans back home, so we don't need that. Don't do the bleach. I can dump it in the thing when we get back to the car. And batteries. Kind of bad. No, okay, apparently that's not an option. Yeah, that's vaguely annoying. There's a hazmat zombie. Having fun with that guy, okay. Now we want to put in the cornmeal, the sugar, the horseradish. Those will keep, bacon will keep, water will keep, the seasoned salt can go away, the bleach, batteries. Other than that, we should be fine. Managed to miss that bit of grass. There we go. Uh, all the wheels are turnable, so we've got a good degree of uh, dodginess for this vehicle. Until I get back, I don't have enough to fill. Um, still no damage. I'm kind of impressed. I was expecting at least one thing to end up damaged. Just because that's how it generally rolls. Yeah, I guess having quite the maneuverable little buggy device here helps quite a bit. Though I just ran over things so that probably, uh, There we go. Stop driving. Zoom in. And there's a zombie. Oh, there's a random case there. That's interesting. A lot more zombies in this place. But they're definitely spread out enough that overall I... S these places are really nice, compartmentalized, and not being a... Oh, a broadsword. Perfect. That's the weapon I want. 
broadsword is literally what I want. I need to deconstruct those things. Oh wow. Hmm. Uh we'll move that over there. I'm not going to be clearing too much, I just want to get the zombies that are nearby. Uh, what kind of arrows is that? That's wooden arrows. Mm -mm, no, it's just not my style. There we go. Head back into the library. So there was a door on the other side. I'll want to go check that out as well. Well, not door, but you know. A place, a thing, stuff. Actually, no, think about it. I should probably wield the said weapon that I was wanting to wield. Um, let's see. It's a uh, 835 with a plus 2 and 111, whereas the arming sword is 1534 plus 1, 119. It's a bit of a difference, but I think that's partly because I haven't, uh, actually, yeah, I haven't fully, uh, I haven't made it nice yet. Any zombies in here that would interrupt me? Nope, and eh, nothing too interesting. Um, I'll take that. Try to clear out this area right here. We should be fine to loot that place. What? That's weird. I guess there's just kind of a spot to go through. It's definitely not intended. Through the lens. That sounds learny. Survivor note, what's it say? Broadswords, yeah. Yeah, I know, broadswords are pretty good. All that in mind, I need to start working on this stuff. All going there. We've got another through the lens. Huh. Now we're at the one thing. Right now I'm doing it like this, and that's a problem. In the past, I was using a different recording software, and what I would do is I'd just pause the recording and everything would be fine, right? The big problem is I have to manually sync now to do stuff, and that is a pain in the... Mm. So I'm mostly going to be talking as I move a ton of books around. I am happy with how many red books there are. I mean, well, obviously the ones with the numbers aren't that important overall. But besides that, everything else is pretty good. Of course, there's a bunch of random stuff I don't actually care about. But I'll deal with that on my next pass-through. Got a lot of the same book over and over. I can't blame it. Oh wait, uh, I saw something. Um, actually, do I have that martial arts? No, I don't. Um, that's one of the reasons I want for this. Let's see, does it say in here? I'm not seeing it, but there's a martial arts that goes with it. I think it was Ayajat. Ayajat's jets. Words. It's a name. I can't pronounce it. It's a martial arts. So I'll have to raid some dojos or something. Neither here nor there. Oh, 
of the lethal survivor note, as you say. One of those robot tanks was blocking the way out. Got some sort of sweet spot, though, where I can't decide what to shoot with maybe 30 yards or so. Maybe made it to the truck and just drove. Well, that's useful, hint. Ooh, crafting for beginners. Now that is a novel. We'll uh, have to figure out all we can from that. Yeah. I've mostly finished with the gear that I want after I get if I have computer skill somewhere in these books. I haven't been paying enough attention. But if I have computer skill and I can get that up to a decent amount, I want I can I need to go check the mine if I can try again if I can. Once I can uh, do that, I should be fine. But yeah. So obviously it's not end all be all. But yeah, it's just life sometimes. Not many books along there. Definitely all this has got random junk I don't actually need. Flying spaghetti monster. Cute. Okay. Luckily all this is relatively small stuff, so it won't fill up. There we go. Um, modern swordsman to a handgun. I hope there's, uh... It actually takes longer somewhat overall to do it, just having it transfer all of them. On the other hand, when you do it like this, you actually see the stuff happening which is a good benefit. And the other thing is that when you're doing it like this, it also, uh, what's it? Words. Okay, now the important step of deciding what to bring. Take that. Um, I don't think I need that. The food, of course, we'll take crafting for beginners, one, one home repair, wrestling moves, street firefighting. I've got that already. Um, I should have that. I'm not sure, so I'll grab it. Ooh, this will be useful. Um, it might make me change out my engines to being diesel. Uh, I do have that. Computer science, that's what I needed. I think that's a religion book. Ooh, healthcare is always needed. How to browse the web? Perfect. How to drop anything? Knife fighter notes. I should have this. Just in case I don't, I'm taking it. Same with that. It's another religiony thing. More knife techniques. Survivor's note. Apparently, I've already got everything I can from the book of first aid. Five rings, complete guide to picturing. Uh, religion, obviously. <laughs> Oop, I didn't want to put two of those. Mother helper, I've got that for certain. Ooh, historic weaponsmith, that's nice. Swordsman, Willow Road, Tau handgun, through the lens, under the hood. That's everything. Um,. These we actually don't have anything we can learn from. Turn on dome light and uh, have something to drink. There we go.
Oh, my inventory is full. Oh, wait, nope. I want to keep the ones that I can use right away. Thing from that's a shame. I'll keep them. Uh, complete home repair. I need construction five, and I'll get my construction update. That'll be nice. Uh, Modern swordsman is complete guy defensing. Guide to pitching. Bring throwing up to three. Another martial arts book. Assuming trap anything is trapping, yes. I don't think I've used trapping. Here's computers up to two, that's really handy. Piercing up to three. First aid up to six. Computer up to three. And unarmed up to three, that's pretty good. Uh, let's see. And I was informed. Press that for more info. Yes. Weapons. I don't know what the diamond stuff is. You can't make it from what I can tell. Maybe you can find it. Fencing works with... Nothing I really need. Judo. Tai Chi. Yeah, no, we'll just keep whatever style we were using already. Didn't get the one I want, but <clears throat> that's life sometimes. Hmm. Though, thinking about it, I should probably actually continue to investigate the house here, just because if it had that stuff already, there's a good chance that we're going to have a lot more of that kind of stuff around. Actually, wield the recore bow and... The uh, quiver. Oh wait, no. Derp. Where quiver? That does make me a bit over encumbered because it's also a around the waist sort of thing. But that's just something we'll have to live with. So with the current kind of a vision range, I'd almost be better off using the nail rifle the moment I'm trying to train this thing. So we should be fine. I'm not too interested in the guns anymore, so we're just going to leave those alone. I'm mostly here for knowledge. Seemed like they uh, damaged something of mine. Yep. Arm guards. Always the damn arm guards. Um, it goes right in my quiver, so I wasn't able to uh, deal with that. Activate. Empty quiver. Those arrows. Put on the auto pickup. Inventory quiver activate. Put those in. There we go. Grab the arrows from over here just so I don't have to go in the Room right away. More books. That's what I was assuming. Since I already had books to begin with, it's likely that the place has more books. 
Uh, that might just be uh, one of those fallacies where it's like it happened before, so it'll happen again, sort of thing. But so far, it's working out okay. I'm assuming it's an actual thing because it seems reasonable. You spawn something with guns and books, and you expect the rest of the house to have guns and books. Right, that's a thing. It's almost as if it was running away. Interesting there, now that I can see. Okay, um... Arms and Armor of Imperial China. Apparently I've read that before. Fair enough. Oh, I was actually running that whole time. That That's not good. I wasn't intending that. I did not want to be running for all of that. I guess it's fair enough that I ran out of breath after that much. Ironica with a holder. I do not need that. Actually picking up a lot less than I normally would this is very much just a loot based run where I'm looking for specific things. And of course food. I, I never turn down food. It's one of those few things that's always useful to have. Hey, cherries. Appears to be the front of the building over there. Or not the front, but uh, one of the sides. Yeah, I think I actually have that one packed in the cart, so yeah. But so far we've made a very nice windfall book-wise. Oh, well, that was, that was annoying. We apparently didn't get hardly any arrows recovered from that. That's definitely not a good thing for us. The less arrows we recover, the worse it is for us. I feel like this is over here. Interesting. Oh, this is the center area. Okay. I knew this was here because of the one entrance I found for it. Uh, non drowsy, I'll take the saline solution and that, uh, Dr. Carriage Trimmer. Sure, volume one. Actually, since we're here, actually, I just realized I can probably just dump all these down. Yeah. Definitely don't need to be randomly bringing this stuff around with me. Uh, keep the welding on me though. No particular reason. Yeah, I'm gonna just clear this place up. Well, I really did a number on the stuff over here. Where we took out these dudes? Like, cause they're dead zombies. That they, they, they might have taken it out themselves. Like, that's always possible. Like, they might have just walked over the glass enough to kill themselves. Obviously, I don't have the best of arrows, mostly partly because of weight. I decided to limit myself to the uh, plastic arrows at the moment, and those 
weigh a lot less. On the other hand, they're also uh, a couple. There we go. Yeah. This time I'm not going to uh, do the whole thing. I'm just going to take the books that I need. So this will be quicker. I've got that back in the car. That's because this one, yes, there's going to be a lot more books that are like, oh, I have that back of the car, and I have that back of the car. Which makes life a lot easier. Basically, if it's not red, it's not important. Serve man. Presumably, if I ever wanted to do that, that would be the book. Ooh, lots of stuff. Modern Tanner, I'll take that. And what is the other one? I there was a lot of books I didn't have. I should probably figure out a way to, uh, or not a way to, but I need to uh, stock up on food. Robots for fun and profit. Okay, I like fun and I like profit. I don't mind combining the two. And here's this room. Okay. So we're almost done. Actually, no, we, we are done. Fair enough. The problem is I haven't found an anthill or something. Those are always nice for a supply of food. Used to build a little shack, which was like just a 3 by 3 Worked out pretty well. Actually, keep the ones, keep those. I want to actually go see what they, I'm assuming, yeah, that's trapping. This is electronics. Mmm, brings me up to ten, that is... Oh god, that is such a wonderful thing. That is exactly everything I needed from here. Now I just need all of the food. <laughs> oh, it was actually a Zombie somewhere around. Oh, he's up this way. Fair enough. Guess I can't really stop that, can I? And then I don't need to deal with that. Um, let's go to the cave. Zombie scientist, actually. Apparently I have one that's just randomly in my inventory. There we go. Oh, just a, hmm, not as much as I, ooh, teleporter, never mind, that's, uh, that's potentially a, uh, painful thing. So let's sleep. Dang it, I forgot, frostbite. I was going to put a blanket on here. Please wake up. Okay, there we go. Um, frostnip. on my hand and feet. Cut that all up. I don't have enough rags there, probably. I definitely don't have enough room for that. I do I need for a
sheet. I don't know. Um, can't do much about that. Uh. And uh, with that in mind, let's go see what we got over here. Take the bottle of water. Science ID, always nice. I will not complain about science IDs. Another science ID, a PDA. I didn't grab the PDA. Science ID. Science ID. Okay, there's a lot of stuff here. In fact, there should be enough stuff that I can probably go and make a blanket. Which is very much something I need, apparently. Luckily, I am sort of outside working around, so I'm not being too chilly. That would be almost disastrous, honestly. going to be out and about in the light. I want to give myself a little bit of room to see stuff coming. Cut all you can. There we go. Now I'm just going to figure out where the sheets are. Or something else that would do what I need. Blanket. That's what I want that sheet. A blanket. And that provides warmth 50? Yeah. Covers everything. Taking all the time. Drop. Yeah, I was intending to do this already. But ended up not remembering to. Which is sort of a bad thing. There we go. Or no, uh, like it. There we go. Okay. I think I'll figure out what kind of cave this is first and then we'll be. Ooh, wait a second. Is this a leather farm? I don't know. Might be moles or something. I was hoping it'd be a leather. Or I mean, a giant worms. Oh, it is. <laughs> I find it interesting that suddenly this can at some point go from being a potentially dangerous thing to being, oh hey, food. Nope, uh, cancel that. I just wanted regular cooked meat. There we go. For that in mind, do I want to leave this place or am I good for it? Eh, let's Let's just go look at the cave, as I was saying. 
note worm sightings. Dang it. Still no damage though. That's basically the best I can hope for. No damage. There we go. And stop driving. Defending Ooh, antlered horror. I don't particularly care about the antlered horror. I just need to know if it's on to me. Actually, you know what? I do care about it. And in fact, come at me. Because I cannot have something like that just lying around and wait for me. That would not be good. To chow to. Why in the world did I just say that? I've been thinking about it, so apparently it was on my mind. So there wasn't really anything there. Um, with that, I'm done. I can make it back to the house safely. Uh, the biggest thing is I might see if more worms show up there, because that would be useful. Uh, next time, we should be able to do some fun stuff, as I'm going to read a lot. If anything, I'm going to fly a lot of CBMs, because <laughs> I'll have the skill to then. So yeah, this is Akira Drat, and I'm signing off.